The Nevis football team has absolutely dominated the nine-man football class this season. The Tigers are a perfect 6-0 and are also ranked sixth in the state. And with playoffs looming, they're showing no signs of slowing down. Roaming the sidelines four years ago as a ball boy, Jack DeWolf vividly remembers the last time Nevis went to state. As a junior on this year's team, he says he'll do anything to get that feeling back. Ever since then, I've been telling myself that I wanted to go back and compete there. I mean, it was just the craziest thing. It was so fun being with the team and the whole town, the whole community was behind us, and it's just great. I, would, I just really want that feeling to come back. He and the Tigers are doing their best to make it back to the top of the nine-man ladder, currently sitting 6-0 and with only two games left before section playoffs. We had some team goals. We wanted to go 8-0 and in the regular season. We wanted to win our conference, and then we wanted to go to section championship and win that. Right now we're on a journey. I said don't look at the end, you know, take every week and enjoy the week and what we can get done that week and we'll worry about the week after that. All roads on that journey appear to head through the QRF's top rated team Wabin, but Nevis has no doubts they can compete. Well, Wabin is a tough opponent, but I think we're we're pretty tough ourselves and we put the time in where we're as prepared as we could be. We're ready to Give them the best we got. And while the offense has been the bread and butter for the Tigers, averaging nearly 44 points per game, the team says it's their defense, which only allows an average of seven points per game, that will have to carry them the rest of the way. The defense makes turnovers, gets us the ball back, and, and uh, gives us opportunities to score points. So, I mean, we're set up by our defense. Our defense is real physical this year. Um, we got good team speed, and, you know, that helps. I really think that if we play up to our potential, we can, we can make some noise in playoffs, and we could do big things. We just got to stay strong, keep our fundamentals straight, and just keep working hard. We just want to make the biggest impact we can on the rest of the state. Let them know Nevis is coming. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.